all the AIDS, and all the infidelity make AIDS tests essential. Two million Ugandans are getting AIDS tests this year, paid for by America. They stand in long lines, scrunched up against each other, thousands in one day. Charles Biakuma and his ebullient wife Sarah came to get tested together after three years of marriage. Are you nervous about it? <laughs> I'm curious to know the results. But you're smiling, so you're not very worried. No, I'm not worried. Remarkably, they welcomed us to watch as a counselor handed them their results and asked them to read them to each other. My results are positive. Positive with HIV. And Sarah? My results are positive. Both positive, stunned, and deflated. Oh. At least now, that's not a death sentence. Mary Kibwakali is expecting her second child in a month. Her husband Henry told us, we have a girl, and we're hoping for an heir. As for the AIDS tests? I'm not worried. I don't fear anything. Good luck to you. But luck was not with Mary. You are HIV positive, and uh, the husband is HIV negative. And, uh, when Henry heard that his wife tested positive, we could see him pull away from her. He didn't comfort her when she cried. Mary doesn't speak English, and Henry made it pretty clear their marriage was over. I fear, and I will not be very comfortable to sleep with her. At least finding out now that Mary is positive gives doctors time to minimize the chances that she will pass HIV onto her baby.